I found booty yoga almost exactly a year ago. I had moved to Asheville and most of my days were spent behind my computer. I work from home as a videographer, filmmaker, and um, finding the time to exercise was a struggle, but also finding friendship and finding connection outside of what I was getting from the computer screen and from really telling other people's stories. It was really a focus to try to get back to telling and experiencing really and living my own story and allowing that to evolve and grow instead of feeling and being kind of stagnant. So I ended up finding this class called Booty Yoga. Showed up uh, and just it pretty much blew my mind. The instructor Cynthia was totally free leading this class through this awesome playlist just amazing music and great vibes. The workout was pretty hard, a lot of like intensity going on, um, a lot of jumping and like movement that I had never really seen. Um, I love the dance aspect of it, just that freeing feeling and everything about it, the challenge. So I was like, I think I wanna get certified. I went on my computer, had my credit cards out and everything and just decided to sign up for the booty yoga certification and I planned it out for about six months in advance so the fall and then I looked into it further and I thought it might be good to get an RYT 200 hour yoga certification so I just signed up for that and you know within minutes maybe within a couple like an hour I was signed up to be a yoga instructor and a booty yoga instructor when you know a couple weeks before I had only taken maybe like 10 yoga classes so it was pretty amazing that just from taking two booty yoga classes, I was already making that much of a change through my actions and believing in myself enough to do that. So I was training with the tone videos for that six months and then went to my 200 hour month long immersion. And so by that time it was, you know, I went to my booty yoga certification in DC and that was a weekend long training. We had to do a demo on the second day. So about 15 minutes of going through a typical booty yoga class. I was able to let my personality shine and I was able to step up and be a leader. I was just really happy that I was able to complete that and not choke under pressure, not let any of self doubt, you know, get in the way and I ended up passing and getting my booty yoga certification. And it just felt awesome. I had achieved these two goals that, you know, a year prior to that, I would never even have known I had those goals. But at the same time, it had fulfilled this over, um, overwhelming goal that I had that was get off the computer and be involved in life more and feel Feel what it is to live your life and not just document someone else's life. When you get to that stagnant point, it can be difficult. You know, you don't find your passion. You might not feel as happy or as, you know, have as much lust for life. And so what we have to do is go out and try something new, find a new passion, and then you're reinvigorated and can go back to your work with this new sense of purpose and just refreshed. And another big thing that I learned through booty yoga was trusting your intuition. First of all, through my intuition told me this practice is what's going to change your life and it's going to be positive for you. You know, since then I have made a lot of friends through Booty Yoga, through the community in Asheville. We're able to be our true selves with each other and really share in life together and be a community. You know, so I'm so thankful for the community that I've been able to build up through Primal Studios in Asheville, through the booty yoga practice. And speaking of intuition in another way, when you teach a booty yoga class, you don't show up with, you know, a bunch of notes of exactly what you're going to do in the class. It's actually all intuitive and you're flowing throughout as the teacher. You pick a playlist, you might practice to it a little bit, but what you do is you pull from the moves that you've learned and through the yoga poses that you know and you create this dynamic flow and do the each thing on the left and the right side for the most part. And it's amazing to see how it comes together and the challenges that you feel as an instructor, you have to trust yourself. You're so in the moment, you're so in the flow, and I've been reading a lot about how being in the moment, being present and in the flow, that is what makes people the happiest 
and, and feel the best about their life is when they take those moments to just flow and to not judge it and to not overthink things, just to be a part of the moment that you're in. And that's something I'm so grateful to have as a booty yoga instructor is that ability to do that and to share that with other people and to show them that if I can do that, you can do that in any area of your life. If in any way you feel like there's more for you out there in life and you know you want you want something new, go ahead and try something new. Don't be afraid and don't let anything hold you back from that. Do not give up because it really is out there for you. I know it. It's just a matter of time that you'll find it.